there's dust on Benny. Benny, why are you so dusty? What the heck? Benny's sticky. Benny is sticky for no reason. I don't know why. If you guys don't know, this is Benny. <laughs> Little tiny, tiny camera. We are heading off to Palm Springs. We're going golfing. I've been really uh, in the golfing world lately. Over quarantine, I've just been doing a lot of golf lessons. And so now I'm doing this golf clinic with this new technique that my mom and I are kind of just trying out. We will be golfing with a golf pro for three days. And then my friends are coming up tomorrow. So we're all going to go golfing on Sunday. I feel like an old dude. <laughs> I feel like that's what people do when they're retired. They just go golfing. I have an hour and 30 minutes left on my road trip by myself. Really don't like it. I don't like being alone at all. Got my favorite candy, my Laffy Taffy. I only like the big ones though. I don't like the small ones. Some odd reason. I pulled off in a parking lot, but if you like this video, make sure to hit the like button. Don't forget to comment down below on what you think about my trip. Um, if you have any comments. I always like to keep it positive. I mean, that would be fantastic. What else is there? Oh, hit the bell for notification for more videos. So I get this question a lot. Um, people always ask me what I'm doing. Life after gymnastics, what are you up to? Blah, blah, blah. Honestly, I don't like that question because it's just, what do you want to do with the rest of your life? But then I always feel like you're pressured and you're always thinking about the future that you don't focus on the now and the moment. And honestly, after graduation, I had so much anxiety. I realized that I get very anxious. A lot of issues with all that. And I have not been on YouTube because I felt like I kind of had to figure out my own stuff before I involved my penguins. I'm sorry for leaving you guys, keeping you lost in the dust. What I'm doing now is I was, after college, I decided to go into the entertainment industry because I really, really, really want to go into acting and singing. I just never had the time to. Social media has been a bit, very big part of my life recently. I mean, my TikTok kind of blown up all of a sudden. <laughs> Signed up what I thought was January. I guess I already made an account back in August. I don't remember this though, but TikTok says that I posted a video in August. 2020 when the pandemic hit, I started it in like January. Wasn't really consistent with it at all. Played around with it. Then finally when I got home in March, I started posting like every single day. In May or June, I hit 10,000 followers. So like guys, I was on it for a while. It a really long time to hit 10K. And then I hit a million in September. It was crazy. It's actually wild, but it's been a huge part of my life recently. Recently, but I'm pretty much in the entertainment industry and that's what I'm doing now. I look kind of rough right now with my posture brace and just like no makeup. Okay, I really, really, really wanted to show you my view. Oh, my legs. But look how cool this is. I literally was just staring at mountains and rocks the whole drive pretty much. And all of a sudden, this view. <laughs> A lot of rock it's a lot of nothing but i think it's really cool <laughs> okay i think i'm here i'm so confused so lost but look at the temperature it is 402 and it is already 98 degrees when i was driving i could feel the heat from the inside of my car had to blast the ac it was like 103 degrees that's hot man hot for a canadian mask up mask up buttercup indian palms vacation club i have to pee so bad i don't know where i'm going but it's okay I go oh there's a little boy just walking by himself where are your parents <laughs> Where am I? I feel like I went the right way. Doolittle Street? No, I'm not so sure. Oh, I just have to pee. Oh my gosh, I finally made it. Honey, we're home. This isn't bad. Original thoughts. It's a little scary to be here by myself. Let me open the windows. Maybe some light will help bring some life into this place. Let's do a walk through closet. Hello. I need the bathroom real quick. I feel much better now. Okay, nice kitchen. Not too shabby. Cute little place. Oh, cute. Little patio. Okay, let's go look at the upstairs area. I think this is a pull-out couch. Cute little TV where I can play my Nintendo. Okay, I don't know why these stairs really freak me out. I don't even want to go Oh, I need Brielle here with me. Oh, this is nice. Nice king. I like opening these because make sure no one's in there. <laughs> yep, we're safe, clear. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is a huge closet. What the heck? Okay, there's this random thing on the floor. What? Oh, oh, there's something off about this upstairs and this whole place. It's like creep creeping me out. I don't know if I can survive a night by myself. Okay, the closet shuts. Aw, cute, two twin beds. Lampshade's like all funky. Let's fix that, I'm not even OCD, but oh, it doesn't even go. Okay, I'm gonna have to try and fall asleep real fast cause mm-mm, mm-mm, something is off. <gasps> Maybe I'll sleep downstairs. 
Downstairs less creepy. I really wish I had friends today because now it's creeping me out in here. I should put my diffuser on. You know, walked something in here. All right, it is only five o'clock, but I'm starving, so I'm gonna get an early dinner by myself. I don't like being by myself, if I haven't said that before. Just try and enjoy me time. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm out. I went to go look for a restaurant and it was unsuccessful. I only had like bar food and I didn't really want a burger. But I'm on the phone with Grace Grace. Grace Grace. Oh no, there, there we go. Look, she's doing her nails. So nice. This is what happens when you travel by yourself. You eat in the car and you call your friends. I remember when I said I was gonna eat dinner and then go to get groceries. <laughs> I'm at Dick's Sporting Goods. It is so hot here. I cannot explain how hot it is. I hate sunscreen. I'm gonna try to find some SPF long sleeves because sunscreen, I'm gonna be out on the course from nine to five. And I highly doubt I'm gonna wanna wear sunscreen for that long, so. Dick's week <laughs> With the mesh in here. This is dangerous. This too? This is so bad. I just want everything in this store. I'm getting a car wash now. <laughs> I'm just avoiding going back to the hotel room, really. I am in bed right now. Scary, scary event. Oh, I was unpacking my car from Food for Less and I stepped in a pile of poop and I brought some of it back into the apartment. It smells so, so bad. It smells awful. Ugh. I'm like gonna throw up. Anyways, found it was on my shoe, was trying to clean my shoe. This little girl two apartments down was like, hi, what are you doing? She looked like she was three or four, okay? And I'm like, oh, I'm just, you know, Something was stuck on my shoe, just trying to get it off. This place already creeps me out as it is. And I said, enjoying your time with your family? She goes, yeah, yeah. I said, where are your parents? She said, oh, they're lost. Excuse me? She said, they're lost. I said, oh, what do you mean they're lost? Like, she goes, they're in jail. Huh? Okay, also my eyes aren't very good. It was nighttime. There's other people outside. I'm like, they gotta be hearing this exact same thing. I'm thinking it's a ghost at the window. Like, I am terrified at this point. Then she said something about a ladder. I don't know if she said she like died on the ladder. I'm like, what ladder? I'm like, oh my God, this is terrifying me. I can't wait for my friends to get here because I cannot survive on this place by my own anymore. Good morning. I just had the worst sleep of my life. I feel like this vlog, you're just watching me struggle. It's so hot here, but yet I'm cold at the same time. These kids were out at 2 a.m. in the morning just screaming and the walls are so thin here that I thought they were in my apartment, like I was freaking out. Had a dream that it was pretty much the morning, woke up and it was 2 a.m. I think I tried to go back to sleep, Thought I heard a knock on my door, freaked out again, couldn't fall back asleep naturally. It was six o'clock and these people are just out Side screaming who is up this early and why are they making so much noise? I'm so tired. I am not ready for this heat. There's a heat stroke warning. Yay Tragedy has struck and I did not bring mascara. Oh, mascara is my life it really completes the look and now I'm mad that I don't have mascara. Well, I'm high key about to go to CVS and go get myself some mascara. What time is it? I have time! Yes, so cute! Okay, this is an SPF long sleeve. So it's UV protection, so I don't have to wear sunscreen on my arm. My new hat! I mean, I could have gone without this, but it was so cute, I couldn't say no! My skirt from before. Okay, the poop on my shoe does not smell as bad today. Oh, garbage disposal, that is not what I wanted. We're rushing all because I want mascara. Okay, think it's dumb. Look good, feel good, guys. That's my, pretty much my motto today. All right, I'm about to look for this pile of poop that I stepped in, I can smell it. Right here. Who would poop in the middle of the walkway? Oh, there it is. Disgusting. CVS, my friends! Okay, so I bought mascara really quickly, but I bought this brand, it was like 10 bucks. Not bad. The reason, I, not only because of this trip, guys, also because my audition. Just got two emails that I have an audition, and it's due in two days, so now I have to get this audition done while I'm at this golf thing. All right, let's go to this golf lesson and find out where I'm going. Really, really hot. 
I get more footage tomorrow. I feel like I was just so into it. Now I'm trying to do my audition. Memorizing my lines. We're busy, busy, busy. And my friends are coming soon. Yay! <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. This is Evan. This is Jonas. Yeah. And there is Patrick upstairs. Get our golf on. No cameras, please. <laughs> Jonas. <laughs> and this is Pat. Hi guys. <laughs> to hopefully smoke some straight down the middle. It's like I'm seeing off the children. It's like seeing off the grandpa. I know, yeah, it's true. <laughs> the grandpas, are, the grandpas heading are heading out now. I need to submit my audition this morning, so let's watch some video footage of how I did. Tell, okay. tell us what you're doing. You came all the way across the pond just to just to show us this this lovely turnaround drill. All right, this turnaround drill. So you got to hop on one leg, and then you got to have the club in the air, and we are going to launch the ball off the tee. Oh. <laughs> so those are one of the drills that we're having to do to help our driver. All right, first try. How <laughs> far away do I stand? That's about that's a good distance. Do it. Whoa, got it. Also, Woo. Oh, you got it. Okay. <laughs> I can't it's so satisfying. All right, I'm with Daniel Lee, instructor of uh, Gravity Golf. Aloha. Aloha. Welcome. He's ready to be a content creator. <laughs> He's like, yeah. Game on. <laughs> Dun 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 d